Hello everyone, I'm Rachel from the Innisville Idea Lab and Library, and in today's tips and tricks for Inkscape, we're going to learn more about the intersection tool. This can be found underneath your path menu. Now, we're, it's a way that you can use it as to cut out certain objects or even uh, take different texts and turn them into patterns, which is what we're going to learn today, or even kind of like cookie cutter out different shapes and objects. So the first thing that I like to do is I find a black and white pattern. I'm going to go up to path. I'm going to trace bitmap it, hit update and hit OK. And I should have another one right here. So I can now delete my previous image. And I'm going to use the text tool now and I'm going to create just a letter. And I'm going to go to my move tool and I'm going to just make that larger now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this text have this pattern. So I'm going to remove the fill under my fill and stroke. I'm going to just have a stroke only. And I'm going to go up to the path menu. I'm going to click object to the path. Now this has become an actual object. It is no longer text. I'm going to now move my R on top of the pattern here. And I'm going to click on my edit path tool. I have now selected my text. I'm going to hold down shift and select my pattern. This is very important that you do that in order. So let's look over that again. I'm going to select my text, hold down shift and select my pattern. Now I'm going to go up to the path menu and click on intersection. You should just have your letter, but now it has the pattern cut out of it. And that is this week's tips and tricks for Inkscape. Again, I'm Rachel from the Innisville Idea Lab and Library. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the newest Tinker Shop tutorials. Thanks and have a great day.